Hi, I'm Rita with Diamond Tech, and I'm here to invite you to join us in crafting a green world together, one bottle at a time with the Generation Green Bottle Cutter. One of the neat things about the G2 Bottle Cutter is it's made from recycled aluminum and it'll allow you to score and separate wide mouth jars and large bottles, six ounces to five gallons. The first thing you want to do is choose a bottle for your project. Make sure you remove the label and all glue residue from the surface of the glass. Now, you want to mark the glass where you want the score. And you could do that with a Sharpie pen. Next, you want to adjust the bottle cutter to fit your bottle. Place the cone in the neck of the bottle and make a simple adjustment by loosening the wing nuts and bringing the body of the bottle cutter towards the bottle and tighten it down. Make sure that the body of the bottle cutter is parallel to the bottle. The second adjustment you're going to make is to keep the cutting head at a 90 degree angle to the bottle. At the bottom of your G2 bottle cutter is a six turreted head. You have six blades, which means you've got a lot of cutting from this bottle cutter before you need to replace the head. Now, to make this adjustment, I like to line it up with the seam of the bottle, and then you're going to loosen the wing nut that holds the seven inch bar, and you just want to eyeball it so that it appears to be at a 90 degree angle to your bottle and then you just tighten it down. Now that's going to hold it into place so it doesn't move while you're scoring. Now that you're ready to score, place your hand on the bottle cutter with the palm open. Do not curl your fingers because that will have a tendency to knock the cutter out of alignment. You won't need a lot of pressure. A light pressure will do it. So now, all we need to do is press the bottle against the cutter in one continuous score. And again, light pressure is all you need. And when you hear a gravelly noise like that, that means you're finished. We have found the best way to separate a score is a hot and cold water bath. So the first thing you want to do is simply take your bottle and place it into the hot water for a count of five seconds. Move it and put it into the cold water. Continue this process until your bottle runs and your score separates. All right, here we go. That's a beautiful score. Now you want to, um, because the water is hot, you want to make sure you use tongs to remove it from either the hot or cold water for safety purposes. Your bottle edges will be relatively smooth after the separation, but it's a good idea to smooth them even further. Your G2 bottle cutter comes with two emery papers, a rough and a smooth. We're going to start with the rough and place it into a pie pan or a glass a dish, and we just want to put some water. Now we take the bottle, and all we're going to do is just going to round the edges, just turn the bottle on its side, and continue this process. Step into smoothing it out will be the other emery paper. Just put that right in the water. And continue the same process. Check periodically to make sure how smooth it is. Crafting a green world is easy with the Generation Green Bottle Cutter. Visit DiamondTechCrafts.com for fun and inspirational projects.